What is up you guys? It's the Travel Monk here again and welcome to another vlog. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel The Travel Monkey and please follow me on Instagram at KP the Travel Monkey. So this will be the third part of our Taipei trip. For this day, we didn't really have a guided tour. We will be exploring on our own. We visited the Presidential Palace, Confucius Temple, and Dalong Bawan Temple. And we spent the afternoon in Danjoy. We took a ferry from Danjoy going to Fisherman's Wharf and the Lover's Bridge. And we went back to Danjoy in the evening for the night market. What's really nice about Taipei is that you can go just about everywhere with the MRT. It's so convenient and it's so nice to ride in. And also, can I just say that the people are always so pleasant. They would always give seats to my mom and dad because they're seniors and also because we have an infant. I'm gonna give some details of the places that we went to on the last part of this video, so check it out. bubble tea. My mom had the lemon tea and my sister got the uh, bubble tea. We had milk tea in Jufen but it's not as good as this one. I really like this one. <laughs> The 
presidential palace is just walking distance away from our hotel in Shimen, which is really good. So there is like this free tour daily that you can take during the weekdays, where you can go inside the presidential office and see a little bit of the history of Taiwan and the building itself. It's actually pretty cool. Confucius Temple is open from Tuesdays to Saturdays until 9 o'clock in the evening, and on Sundays, it's open until 5 o'clock in the afternoon. I think they're closed on Mondays. It's free, but donations are encouraged. Dalongdong Bawan is open from half past 6 in the morning till around 10 o'clock in the evening and it's also free but donations are also encouraged. So the ferry that we took from Danjui to the Fisherman's Wharf is around $23 um, for an adult for one way, we took an uber going back to Danjui. Danjui also has a, a big night market But personally, I think that it's not as cheap as the ones like in Shilin, but it's also worth checking out So that's it for our day 3 in Taipei. Stay tuned for the continuation of our Taipei adventure. See ya! Bye!